Hey, how's everybody doing? Everybody doing all right? Good, good, good. So, this is a uh, this is grass or some kind of grass. It is from the game Horizon Forbidden West. I'm in the photo mode now, and in photo mode you can pretty much go like 50 feet or so, maybe 25 meters. I don't know from her. And, you know, you can go up, you can go down, you can look around, you, can, you got all these settings, right? So, anyone who's used Meshroom knows that you can barely much make anything as long as you uh, can get the footage of it, or the screenshots of it. So what I did, what I normally do is, I'll find an area that I won't, and I'll just... Uh, say okay I want that rock there so I'll go around it it's like you would in real life if you're making something for mesh room you got to get all the angles all the sides you don't need a lot of pictures it just depends sometimes you can do get by with like 12 pictures you know I've used a hundred something pictures for myself for my head and upper body and hell it looked like crap it did there's too many too many pictures anyway so I took a screenshot of this and then I went into the photo editor and in the photo editor I pasted it and then I alpha the background I had to say color to alpha and do like uh, two or three different times but the hue you can adjust depends on what kind of grass you want you know, you can change the time of day in the photo mode, but uh, for the most part, you know, it's pretty, uh, pretty much either day or night. And uh, too early in the morning, everything looks orange looking, and too late in the evening, things start looking like a, a blue color. So, this is our image, 2048 by 2048. I don't know how the bottom's going to turn out. Probably not good. But I'll show you how to do this part. So we'll export this into our level. Our level that we are working on is East Coast. So in the art folder, i go going to make a new folder for grass. Call it ground cover. No, ground covers, I guess. Our ground grass uh, so in here we'll save this as we don't want any compression that's gonna ask us so we don't want any all right now we'll close the game here and we will load beam ng so we'll load the east coast now take you into the world editor and we'll make a ground cover with that grass now i can tell you now before you even begin to mess with the grass ground grass right at whatnot there's a little glitch or bug in the game so when you get a new texture on it there's going to be no material. Just save the level and reload it, and then it'll be fine. So, we'll hit F11, and then we will. I guess I need to make a texture for that grass. Uh, so, we'll make a new material. And that material will be known as ground grass. Oh, I got something picked. You got something picked, it ain't gonna let you damn. I hate that shit. You don't want anything selected. So, here we go. Ground grass. So the color map will be the uh, 
the grass that I just saved. We'll see like this here is a preview of the texture. So what we need to do now is lighting adjust the anisotropic filtering and in advance turn the alpha clip on and you'll want to adjust this until you pretty much got rid of the matte lines or whatever you call them the garbage light the trash lines I don't know what the hell they call them uh, you know what I'm talking about though so this will be good we will give it a ground type we'll just call this grass and we will save it now we go to the ground covers so we'll make a new one we will go to here to ground cover well, left mouse button and hit escape now that you got that there you can go to the inspector in the inspector you will put the material that you just made ground grass so you got to tell it what type so what layer will it appear on so you got to get the spelling right too if, you, if it uses caps or not caps so we'll go into the terrain painter and we'll pull up uh, grass Hell, how about grass four? So grass four, or grass three, it don't matter, is using the ground model grass, all capital letters. That's what I needed to know. That's what I needed to know for it to work. All right, let's go back to uh, to that. And then change the, the type layer grass. Now that's the bug I was talking about. Don't worry about it. Just save the damn level, reload it. It'll be fine. This has been a issue since uh, well f for three years now. So it's an easy workaround. Just reload the level. That's all you got to do. And you'll have you some pretty grass. I'll probably have to adjust the picture. Make it look a little better. How the hell do I get over here? That ain't where I was at. Hell, I don't even remember where I was at now. I guess we'll just go over here. And we will put our new grass down. Well, it's already down. We're going to adjust it. Ground grass gonna be where grass is. There's gonna be um, how many? How many? Many? How many? Um, what? Fifty thousand. Five hundred thousand. Five hundred thousand. We'll make some of them large and some of them small. And there we go. Now if I want to adjust the color, I can easily do that in the material editor for that grass. I can adjust it here. Or I can go back to the photo editor if I needed to and adjust it there. But I'd rather just do it here. It's a lot easier. So you adjust these colors. Which is pretty cool, I guess. You get it exactly how you want it. Or you can make it glow if you want to. But anyway, I think that's going to be it for this. I hope you got something out of it. We got us some new grass here.